ਸਤਿ ਜੀ ਨਮਸਕਾਰ ਸਰ ਗੁੱਡ ਟੂ ਸੀ ਯੂ ਥੈਂਕ ਯੂ ਸਰ ਵੈਰੀ ਐਕਸਾਈਟਡ ਟੂ ਯੂ نو ਯੋਰ ਯੂ نو ਸਾਈਕਲਿੰਗ ਐਡਵੈਂਚਰ ਐਂਡ ਸਟੋਰੀ Namaste everyone. Let's start our today's Global Yoga session. I am Vaidehi Sote, your today's host. I welcome you all on this platform. Since last August, we had started Global Yoga uh, on India's 75 years of independence. And today we have completed 78 sessions. Also, I welcome Rajendra Sote ji on behalf of Swasti Yoga Center. Uh, I request everybody to be relaxed. we'll start with omkar chanting and prayer everybody can unmute themselves completely relaxed eyes closed inhale and exhale inhale inhale and we'll start the omkar inhale So today we have a uh, eminent speaker with us uh, Rajendra Sote ji he is a uh, well qualified he has a degree in mechanical engineer mba finance he is retired from tata motors uh, last year he was a senior manager in tata motors he, uh, he did a 42 years service in tata motors also 
He has an attachment for cycling, gardening, tailoring, singing, and social activities. Interior decoration that is carpentry, uh, fabrication, painting, and etc. Also, so he is today going to talk about uh, cycling. Why is it important? He is going to guide us how we can save our planet with small steps. And also, he is going to tell us the importance. Of being healthy and also making our planet healthy. So over to you, Rajendra ji. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you on uh, for giving me this opportunity to tell you something about cycling. Namaste. See, good evening. Uh, good evening, everybody. I am very happy to say something about cycling. Cycling is my uh, hobby, and let us start about uh, cycling. Cycling new age mantra for health and environment conservation. See, we have uh, heard the word about conservation. of environment conservation is very important as the next generations they are coming and we have to preserve something for them each and every drop is very important see cycling is new age mantra for health and environment conservation now let us get about self introduction i am rajendra chothe my qualifications are degree in mechanical engineering as mba finance is my post graduation and i was working at tata motors tata motors limited is very big company and is a worldwide company we have got seven big branches in india one is at uh, pune is a main plant jamshedpur then lucknow dharwad then uttar uh, means many of the seven seven places are very very wide branches are there Eleven hundred acres of land is there for each and every plant. So, so big uh, plants are there. My hobbies are long distance cycling, gardening, then tailoring, then singing, social activities, and interior decoration. It it covers carpentry, fabrication, construction, and painting. So, with the number of hobbies, live hobbies, I am very uh, delighted to get each and every moment of my life. and i am putting some energy into my life because of these hobbies 24 by 7 i am always busy and uh, most of the things which i am doing they are consisting of social activities since last 23 years i am in the social activities for my uh, devang koshi samaj organization here we are conducting some some uh, programs which are helpful for students as well as uh, young generation and to arrange their marriages so we are conducting big programs where i am acting as a anchorer for that program 5000 people they come together from india as well as abroad also and we are arranging some marriages it, it, it helps for arranging marriages so like matrimony and uh, for this long distance cycling as such this is my hobby since last 40 to 43 years cycling is my hobby so i have i am putting much of the energy into cycling and recently i had a nepal cycling tour and I'll, i'll tell you a details about uh, this cycling tour in the next slides now about the coming towards life cycle sketch sketch so see cycle always cycle word will come because it's entire life cycle so on behalf of that i just uh, putting this uh, energy into life with the life cycle so my life cycle sketch is so see i have realized significance of hard work and value of money on one side there was economically adverse situation and other side my dream to become an engineer and sports cyclist i wanted to become a sports cyclist very big cyclist and this dream is coming true uh, in near near future so however my destiny was something different I joined Tata Motors Limited on 19 September 
that time it was called as telco so telco it was very inspiring company like climbing ladders i attained part time a qualifications so i was only ssc that time and after ssc i was there in tata motors i was been admitted as well, i was been selected through thousands of boys i was selected so after joining tata motors i have, i just completed my nctvt national uh, council for trades in vocational trades so after that i have just at, uh, joined with diploma in mechanical engineering for government polytechnic pune and after that uh, immediately after completing this diploma in mechanical engineering i wanted to become an engineer it was my dream when i was in fourth standard means i was of 10 years old that time i decided that i'll be i'll become an engineer and i'll work for some good work for nation so immediately i joined for this uh, degree in mechanical engineering college then uh, even after completing that i completed diploma uh, means mba finance mba finance that to throw distinction and it was very uh, means pleasurous thing for me then simultaneously ensured development of my family cycling running and social activities such social activities also for they were, uh, I, in between i got so many awards also for my social work as well as cycling so deva devang puraskar award for year 2018 and special achievement award for 2019 also i achieved special achievement pune nepal pune cycling award for 2022 recently i got this award which uh, is there in next slides so i am very happy and it's, it's a continuously improvement process in my life i am very happy to see all these things now cycling different cycling records which i have done in uh, till today but henceforth there will be more progress because i am totally retired now means not tired i am re uh, retired from tata motors only but i have started my journey with with tremendous speed now recently i had a longest cycling ride in my life that is pune nepal pune which was which was 6130 kilometers so it was big journey it's very joyous journey it is very pleasant journey pleasant journey and it was very it was having rich experience of cycling as well as social activities and environment care so total kilometers of cycling which i had done in my life it is around about 2.5 lakhs kilometers 2.5 lakhs means it is 250000 kilometers i am cycling from 1978 so it is a 42 to 43 years total experience is there for cycling so i got tremendous confidence life confidence as well as cycling life confidence so maximum distance cycled within a day means within a day within within and 12 hours day means uh, 24 hours day i have cycled 250 kilometers in one day these are six occasions means uh, somebody from uh, means uh, you may be knowing kolapur city kolapur city to pune within a day i can come means it was my record for six times okay now uh, looking towards this uh, number of trips mean cycling distances covered for uh, different trips that is pimpri pali pimpri pune there is 320 kilometers pimpri karad pune it is 400 kilometers pimpri oglewadi pune is 410 kilometers then pimpri kasudi pune this is 190 kilometers so pimpri renavi pune is 580 kilometers so like this i have completed very joyous journeys of cycling so pimpri kalewadi uh, kolewadi then oglewadi vita pune this was of 550 kilometers entire empire state means where i am staying it's chinchwad to vita and chinchwad pune this is of 530 kilometers then chinchwad pandrapur pune it was of 510 kilometers chinchwad elora ajanta it was very joyous journey very nice sculptures of this means ancient people they had done marvelous things for us so ajanta anybody uh, for anybody uh, who is possible should visit to ajanta and elora caves it's very very beautiful caves so chinchwad bhor chinchwad is 220 kilometers chinchwad ahmednagar chinchwad is 220 kilometers then chinchwad jog falls jog falls is a karnataka Gokarna and uh, Murdeshwar. It's a very nice place. It's it's at sea seashore is there. Every means everything is beautiful. So so good thing means it is Jog Fall is the second largest fall in in the world. So which I have visited, and when that was a rainy season, I was just uh, means getting with rain was it was totally continuously for eight hours. Then also I was cycling for that. 
and I completed this 1600 kilometers cycling. So Chinchwad, uh, Chinchwad then Baudan, Katras, 210 kilometers. Like this, I have covered so many uh, picnics or maybe trips, cycle uh, tours in my life. And after that, this biggest cycling tour which I had is uh, Pune, Nepal, Pune cycling. So very nice thing to achieve all these things. Very happy to see. Then cycle gets balanced only when it is in motion. See, you may be knowing that when, when we are steady or stationary, that time we are observing that life is, life is becoming a little bit it is boring. But when we are in motion, always we are doing something. 24 by 7, we should be busy. So like this, cycle gets balanced only when, we, when it is in motion. So that is a very important part of life. So always we should be in motion. So like cycle. Cycle teaches us about we should be in motion. That, that is the lesson from cycling. So cycling gives life confidence and power to find out solutions to any problem. If you are, uh, you are facing yourself that you, I am in problem, something like that. And if you start cycling, you will come to know that you are, you are making your mind very joyful. So like this, it, there are so many advantages. So increases cardiovascular fitness. So no doubt it is for all your main muscles, every muscle, part of our body gets exercised with cycling. Increases muscle strength and flexibility with joint mobility. Cycling gives money and maintains precious health. So very nice advantage of cycling. Science of positive psychology uh, invest, investigates that uh, makes life most worth, uh, worth living. Cycling seems to possess an array of attributes that boost happiness in ways that few other sports can claim. So cycling is the best exercise we are saying. And myself, I absorbed. So that is why I continued cycling for 43 years, maybe knowing. I have given spiritual touch for cycling. See, one can achieve many of the things together with, the, with your happiness to go ahead. So Shraddha and Saburi, somebody might have visited, uh, many of the people might have visited Shirdi Sai Baba. His thoughts were that patience and faith, PF. Even after service life also, what we are getting is PF. It is not PF, but it is patience and faith. So after retirement, means when you retire, so that time it requires patience and faith. It's a spiritual part of yoga. So that I added into our cycling world. And whenever I'm cycling, I'm always keeping those two words together in front of me. That is Shraddha and Saburi. Then only you can do something which is beautiful. So for cycling tours, willpower is most important thing. So willpower. So other than our physical power, maybe body power, it is more important that what willpower we have. Even in darkness also, we can find the way if willpower is there. So it is the beauty of that cycling. Cycling is a new age mantra for health and environment conservation. See, here is very beautiful thing about cycling, which is about cycling is one, uh, is, uh, is the thing which runs on fat and saves you money. Cycling saves your money and it runs on fat. Whereas same thing I compare, compared with a uh, car also. So car runs, car runs on money and makes you fat. Whereas it is exactly opposite. Your fats are get, uh, means getting burned and it saves your money. So we have observed that so many people, they are joining their clubs, gyms, and many of the things together. They are, they are giving fees of thousands of rupees. And while going for that club, they are just uh, coming outside their home and calling the lift. We have got lift outside our building, means uh, inside our building. So we are calling lift. To go downstairs also, we are calling lift. So it is just wasting energy. We are wasting our energy. See here what cycling says, it runs for your fats and it saves your money. Economical balance as well as physical balance, mental balance. All three balances cycling is doing. See, and car, what it, what it does, you have to take care for its maintenance. You have to take care for petrol. You have to take care for so many things together. And even after that, whenever it is having some problem, you cannot proceed further. So that is the beauty of cycling. And that is why we have to have cycling in our life. So our life cycle will get balanced. 
Now, second picture says about your Ajanta Alora Kales. Ajanta Kales, these are the, I think, most of the people, they may, may be knowing this place. Even Indian people, they were not knowing that this, such a beautiful place is there in India. When a British person, he was have, uh, hunting for uh, some animal, or he gone there and uh, he was searching for tiger. But uh, tiger was not coming outside. So he found that there may be something inside. So he gone there. It was so dense forest that time. And uh, he just uh, saw that there were 30 different caves carved with such a beautiful sculptures. Buddha, Gautam Buddha's, so many uh, statues are there, means carved. Whatever uh, statue is there, it is of the same stone where entire temple is of that particular stone. So, whatever unwanted materials they have removed, and that time it was such a dangerous thing that even to stand for five minutes, it was not possible that time because entire animals will just kill you. So, within that different difficult situations, they have created such big, big and marvelous stones, marvelous uh, caves. So, this is what I have visited five times. Five times I have visited this such a, such a beautiful place. So, I am requesting everybody to whom it is possible, they should visit an entire uh, entire things, uh, such a beautiful things in India. They tells you about ancient people, what they could have done. So, third picture, it says about Zog Falls. Zog Falls, second largest fall of the entire world. So, it was crazy thing. So, it was so beautiful. In Diwali seasons, I visited uh, Zog Falls. And it was raining outside. It's a dense, rain, heavy raining. So, I was... Just, I can't, I have no words to explain this particular experience. So, it's such a beautiful thing. Now, coming towards next slide, why we should keep on cycling? So, advantages of cycling as it is a social cause, that is the first thing. So, whenever it is a social uh, thing, so we should, we should uh, maintain this particular thing for our, uh, as a social responsibility. So, then uh, meditation while cycling. If you go to Google, we may find so many videos about how cycling is helpful for health as well as even mental health also. If we are facing some problems for uh, for some boringness or maybe maybe some illness about, so that also can be avoided with the help of cycling. And if we if it is added meditation with a cycle cycle riding, then it is more advantageous. So, life environmental cycling, then campaigning awareness about cycling. So, what I'm doing is whenever I'm outside for cycling, I'm carrying my mic also with me and I'm giving some lectures about cycling, meditation, yoga and cycling, how it is important for our life, how it helps our entire family structure also, how we are balanced and how we are fit for our entire life, that cycling tells you about that. So, cleanliness drives to cycling progress. So, we have got a team. So we are cleaning our uh, even uh, road sides also, even temples also, some social places. We are visiting and we are cleaning it with cycling bloggers, cycling groups. We are planting trees also. We have planted 2,000 tree, trees. Uh, see, uh, we know that uh, today is environmental day. So we have planted 2,000 trees and we are taking care for last three years and they are live trees. So it is very nice to see all these places where, where we, are, we are taking care for environment. So life fitness and environmental neatness is saving in money. We can save money also. Simultaneously, it is, it is entire things are uh, getting balanced. So what we can say is about how I can cycle, how to start a boat. So big question which is coming. Whenever I'm traveling, the people, they ask what? I have interest for cycling, but I have not cycled. <laughs> so it is not possible. So, but, but if you have interest, little bit, one person interest, even if you have, you should purchase a cycle. And cycling, purchase a cycle is very easy thing. From 5,000 to 10 lakhs, we can get a cycle. It is ranging from 5,000 or maybe 3,000 also. 3,000 to 10 lakhs is the cost of cycle. So we, we can purchase even cycle of 3000 rupees and we have to decide that at least I'll cycle for three kilometers within a day. That also enough. 
even if you cycle for three kilometers, then also it will save lakhs of crores rupees for your country. One forty crore people, if we'll cycle, they will cycle for three kilometers. Then the mathematics is something different. I'm a, I'm a mechanical engineer. Maths is very powerful for me, but I'm not showing this entire statistics for this particular moment. But but everybody should keep in mind that they should at least cycle for three kilometers. Even if suppose we are going for market, we can we can get our cycle outside, and we can we can start cycling even. There is no need to take separate time for cycling. So it gets balanced. So if suppose you are uh, going for your office, you can cycle it because it needs no separate time for your cycling. See, last so many years, I remember I am not uh, even taking car to my office. My office is uh, seven to ten kilometers nearby uh, my house. So I am cycling every day. So twenty kilometers cycling is very means it is possible for everybody. So they should start cycling. So cycle for beginners that should be maintained cycle. Cycling is very easy. Even cycle is very nice vehicle, but but cycling is very dangerous if proper care is not taken. It is very dangerous. So cycle should be always maintained condition and checked bicycle for rides. So helmet and shoes with proper and safe dress. So we should have particular dress for cycling. We should use helmet. We should use shoes because if if we fall from means if some accident happens, then in the first stage there is a possibility of injury to your head. Head injury is very very dangerous. We are all from medicine, medicine yoga field, or maybe from medical field. So we know how dangerous it is. So we have to take care for our head. Then enjoy rides of minimum three kilometers per day. Then cycle for fun and fitness. So, very nice fun we can achieve from cycling and fitness also and because of uh, this fitness from mental fitness body fitness means health fitness we can automatically get a smile on our face if body means physical fitness and mental fitness they are balanced then automatically uh, that entire particular stage we can say means some some beauty it comes on our face then try cycling at safe places always so for beginners i'll request that you should try cycling for same safe places should be safety should be there means there should not be it should not be a crowded area like garden or society you follow all the traffic rules for cyclists cyclists is uh, taking casually he he doesn't follow traffic rules but cyclists should always follow the traffic rules and beginners if they start with some safety precautions and traffic rule then it will be his habit and he will enjoy cycling so that will be the sequential uh, pleasure they will be getting for because of cycling so this is about beginners then uh, cycling awards which i have got in my life so recently i had uh, received many of the awards so that is about uh, it was pimpri jinchwal municipal corporation pcmc it is at pune pimpri jinchwal i have i was been honored with uh, the puraskar and that was beautiful trophy as well as uh, shawl sripal very nice and it was been, been given by uh, pimpri jinchwal mayor that is uh, mai dore it was very very nice program then uh, so many papers uh, news that newspapers they are taken care for my nepal cycling tour as well as uh, even so many awards for that also so many papers were uh, there and i was been interviewed by three four different tv channels so i am telling them self them that uh, they should take care about environment and how environment is important they should highlight for that particular topic so like that they have just taken care about that then this third picture says about uh, it was for trophy which i achieved from this cycling tour for nepal pune pune nepal and same is the case for fourth picture also now this is the trophy which i have got for this uh, cycling to nepal pune pune nepal then uh, in my lifetime i have got one more trophy which was been given by dr vikas and shwetambari shwetambari had written one poem on this particular trophy and it is 
this i wanted to read this at moment so this is written in marathi but it is very nice dr shwetambari she had given me this uh, valuable award in my lifetime which i'll preserve it for my lifetime so ayushya don taka varche kasli ti shakti ani prerna ti kay नेपा ट्रीप साइकल वर कराए ध्येय का बधुनी नेपा ध्येय अंगी प्रवास सुरू आनंदी आशीर्वाद संगे नेहमी शुभेच्छा तयाला न कशाची तमा न कशाची भीति जिद्द बधुनी मनाला सरसर साइकल चाली पोचली ती भोपाला शी हेड मेन्शन ऑल द सीटीज एंड वर्ड्स आर वेरी वेरी नाइस एंड सो स्वीट वर्ड्स वेरी लवली वर्ड तिथुन थे स्वारी राजिटिंग टू अयोध्या मन तृप्त बगुनी राम मंदिर आला सी फॉर इंडिया एट दिस मोमेंट फॉर इंडिया राम मंदिर इज द इज द गोल्डन इश्यू मीन्स गोल्डन सब्जेक्ट फॉर अस एंड इट इज बीइंग कंस्ट्रक्टेड सो इट इज जस्ट जस्ट वी आर फीलिंग वेरी वेरी हैपी एज वेल एज वेरी रिच फॉर अस वेन राम मंदिर इज गेटिंग कंस्ट्रक्टेड मग आली ती घटिका स्वप्न आले पणाला हृदयाची घटका चुकली नेपाळ बॉर्डर दिसता डोळ्याला मीन्स वेन आय एम लुकिंग टुवर्ड्स नेपाळ बॉर्डर और नेपाळ आय वॉज सो डिलाइटेड अँड शी हॅड ऑल्सो एक्सप्रेस इन द सेम फिलिंग सो यू कॅन इमॅजिन दॅट हाऊ अवर वेव्ज आर इंटरलिंक्ड माय सन अँड माय डॉटर इन लॉ हाऊ दे आर टेकिंग केअर फॉर माय लाईफ सो बघता बघता परी परतीचा प्रवास सुरू झाला रिटर्न जर्नी स्टार्टेड अनेक संकटावर मात करून पोहोचले मन आनंद म्हणाला अहिंसेचे व्रत घेऊन भेट दिली सेवाग्रामला आशीर्वाद घेण्या गुरूंचे मन पोहोचले शेगावला शेगाव इज द प्लेस व्हेरी मीन्स फेमस प्लेस शेगाव गजानन महाराज अशा प्रकारे अनेक संकटावर मात करून प्रवास सफल झाला खूप अभिमान तुमचा नेहमीच आम्हा वाटला only you can make it possible heartiest congratulations papa very proud of you dr shwetambari jothe 8 4 2022 it was very nice uh, trophy which was been given by my uh, daughter in law very very uh, thankful for this particular trophy it will be a lifetime achievement for me <laughs> very nice so going towards next slide so care for environment how we we are taking care for environment that cycling says about this so please have cycling ride and tree plantation at least on your birthdays to save environment you are not doing anything it's no problem but at least on your birthday that day you are very happy you are so delighted that day at least you plant a tree at least one tree so that will give you pleasure for this so, so you will save environment so you can plant trees on uh, online also even if that is not possible you can go for tree plantation with online nowadays it's a age of science you can at least by one click they will plant one tree for your name so there is one uh, you can plant a trees online with the help of ecoshare app every search they will plant a tree if you will go for one search they will plant one tree you will keep some more then will keep some more trees for you means it will be for next generation you can get involved into nature because of cycling what happens is you are getting involved directly towards your nature and there is no other thing other than getting in involvement in nature so it's very pleasure pleasant journey so by that uh, besides that what we have to do is we should we should save the water electricity and food so these three things we should save and we should preserve this for next generation so going to the next slide so what about long bicycle rides so long bicycle ride it requires tremendous things means will power is the first thing and you should have courage to go up there means it was my solo ride and uh, recently whatever cycle rides i had these are solo rides solo cycling means you are going alone by entire forest as well as entire all the roads you are just passing through these roads alone with your cycle so preparation of cycling tour how how we should prepare for cycling tour so for that what we should carry with you and your sack so that is air pump 
you should carry air pump with you because there is a possibility that it may it may travel you so you should have pump in your your sack so puncture kit to take out puncture for your cycle then allen keys different allen keys you should carry with you spanners goggle helmet then gloves very uh, nice gloves uh, sets are there so reflector jacket whenever you are passing through uh, means uh, traveling then you should have reflector jacket because person who is back side you uh, he should he should be, should be able to trace you and there should be a reflector jacket so headlight battery headlight should be there so that uh, you can focus uh, towards your object and uh, you can see even in darkness also with a, you should carry all the chargers also for that then digital guide there are many of the different digital guides are available nowadays so we can have we can get help of that particular instruments so will power is more important than body power physical power what our body power physical power other than that will power or mental power is very important you should have ambition to reach that towards that target cycling for fun and fitness is very important is whatever we are doing it's for fun and it's not that i have to cycle up to that distance no just pedal once it it lasts for another pedal so it is moment you get a pedaling then another step comes so it gives you it is just giving on bonus uh, pedals so you will you will enjoy uh, another pedal then cycle goes automatically in the next stage then pune nepal pune i'll i'll tell you some experiences about pune nepal pune cycling longest cycling with meditation and spiritual yoga tour it was it was not cycling tour but it was spiritual tour yoga tour i just covered six different uh, means lord shankar temples there are there are 12 jyotirlingas in our india so out of that i have just covered six six jyotirlingas ayodhya then so many spiritual places i have visited so cycling route was here from junnar it is Pal palastika means bhima shankar huh? then after that i have gone to this nasik trembakeshwar then i uh, just traveled to indore indore uh, ahilya devi holkar is a palace is such a beautiful palace and lady from maharashtra she gone to madhya pradesh and she had empire at that ujjain palace and uh, so many surrounding places there she had developed it very nicely then i visited bhopal bhopal rajwada then uh, so many temples and then i i visited birla temple hanuman mandir then uh, after bhopal i just visited khajuraho cave khajuraho temples so beautiful marvelous uh, temples are uh, there where carving is done then chitrakoot prayagraj prayagraj where uh, means uh, triveni sangam is there previously it was named as elabad but nowadays it is uh, prayagraj where three rivers are coming together ganga yamuna and saraswati saraswati is gupt means uh, is a hidden hidden river we can see triveni sangam there where it is a beautiful place uh, which we can see so varanasi means kashi kashi vishwanath after kashi vishwanath i i just visited baltar atrol then kushinagar where gautam buddha's uh, last means place uh, mahapari nirvan place is there then i visited ayodhya prabhu shri ramchandra's janma means uh, birth place then nepal kapilvastu kapilvastu is the place where gautam buddha was staying with uh, with his family kapil kapilnagar and he was his empire at kapilvastu then i visited his birthplace gautam buddha's birthplace lumbini after that i visited kathmandu kathmandu is such a beautiful city in nepal is a uh, it means kathmandu after kathmandu i visited pashupatina lord pashupatina temple is is also very nice and it gives you tremendous pleasure of your journey janakpur i have visited means 700 kilometers and uh, throughout uh, nepal i just uh, cycled myself so many big ghats ghats means uh, mountains are there and valleys are there so to pass through those uh, roads it is it is a challenging task for you nature is so beautiful and so many temples so many means beautiful people are there they are supporting you like anything 
then after uh, janakpur i have visited i was uh, pass means getting out through that uh, gate uh, nepal gate and i have uh, india gate then sitamarthi i visited where sitamata's birth place is there then gaya gaya is lord vishnu's uh, mandir is there is very uh, famous for uh, hindu people generally they visit it at least once in their life so bodh gaya bodh gaya where gautam buddha he has achieved his knowledge below this people tree is bodh gaya 80 80 feet long uh, statue is there so so very very nice statue uh, it is sitting statue then hemalkasa anand van then uh, sevgao then uh, seva gram amravati amravati segao ajanta elora vrishneshwar so these places these places i have visited then then these are some of the cycling clips where i have gone throughout my journey this kapil vastu is a nepal after uh, passing through nepal gate just i have gone through kapil vastu this is what about uh, in between this is khajuraho caves khajuraho temple then this is about kashi uh, vishwanath um, ayodhya's temple then kashi vishwanath temple so after that uh, this this is about kashi vishwanath this is about uh, khajuraho caves this is about pashupatinath mandir this temple so for that uh, when i was visiting this i have observed that nepal people are very nice to cooperating means uh, they are so sweet people so this is about how uh, they are just they are uh, just asking for my india to nepal tour and uh, they are helped me for some cases these are cycling uh, cycling boys they they were for morning ride when i was from kashi vishwanath to um, means uh, i was traveling through nepal that time some boys were uh, there for morning ride so i i just discussed with them what about cycling and i just inquired about so many things together and this is about india and its neighboring tourist countries so we have so many so many good countries around india so one of them is bhutan bangladesh myanmar then thailand cambodia Vietnam, Laos, Malaysia, Indonesia, Sri Lanka, Pakistan, Afghanistan, Maldives. So many beautiful countries are there around India, and so we can think of visiting some places <laughs> in future also. So life is about cycling, and it's Ayushya don't talk about it. Means life is on two wheels. We have two legs. Means these are all wheels. So why not to convert it into cycling wheels? and let us keep cycling so third june is the cycling day just before two days it was a cycling day and i am getting opportunity very nicely on 5th of june which is environmental day on which all of you have given me an opportunity to talk something about cycling as well as yoga cycling so for cycling what we can say is cycling uh, we should be adopted with the present situation whenever we are on cycling tour we should not say that i should get this type of situation only so situation whatever situation situation is there you have to convert it into your own situation and you have to make it pleasant so that you will enjoy the things so same is the case with even wherever you are there whatever situation is there you have to convert it into pleasant situation and it is possible when you are adapting to your entire situation present situation so then only it is possible so whatever spot you are visiting you should get entire knowledge you should think about about their language what are their habits of people what is the temperature there what things i should carry to go there so that all these things should get studied so whenever we are uh, getting enjoyment about nature that time we should think of uh, think of even next generation of also and we should keep cycling as per as whatever joy we are getting for that we have to keep on cycling so this is what about my cycling 
Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Namaste, Rajendra Ji. Sau Pratham Sastang Virtual Dandavat Pranam. Yeah, it was. It is so fascinating. Uh, you know, I I got some takeaways, right? Which probably will be helpful for everyone. Uh, you have what you call, you know, uh, Sansar Chakra. I mean, let me try to put it in Hindi, right? Probably English may not be. कि संसार चक्र को समझना है तो आपके द्वारा थोड़ा समझने का प्रयत्न किया एंड दैट्स थ्रू साइक्लिंग तो या यू हैव यू हैव मैनेज एंड यू हैव एक्सेल इन संसार चक्र सो वेल विद साइक्लिंग एंड इन फैक्ट यू नो क्लबिंग इट विद एनवायरनमेंट एंड योर कंजर्वेशन सो या दैट इज सो प्राउड अनदर टेक अवे व्हिच आई हैव नॉट हर्ड बट आई एम गोइंग टू प्रोबब्ली कैरी इट यू नो थ्रू द रेस्ट ऑफ माय लाइफ दैट्स व्हाट आई वुड से you know i heard you saying that you know cycle uh, saves money and burns fat and yes. you know the car uh, burns money and you know uh, makes fat okay so yeah so wonderfully said and yeah it absolutely i mean it's amazing that uh, even if we even if we can you know do even a small little of what you did you know through cycling i think uh, that will be that that definitely would be great so yeah thank you so much yeah it was quite fascinating and uh, again hope you know you cycle for many many thousands of years and uh, i really like that poem you know i could understand uh, definitely a, a little in hindi but that also shows you know another what you call facet of uh, swetambari ji and uh, good you know father in law and daughter in law bond so so wonderful thank you so much i request everyone to unmute themselves and have a big round of applause for rajendra ji so this is a felicitation from swasti yoga cycle to rajendra ji thank you so much for helping us to uh, telling about cycling helping us to do something for the environment so next saturday we have dr sujata shingare she is the yoga protocol instructor at swasti yoga center and her topic is uh, the yoga most pressing need so we will thank you for this session with the shanti mantra we will end this session everyone be comfortable relax eyes closed Inhale and exhale. Inhale and then start the omkar. in your hands we chant the shanti mantra then sarvada bhavatu sarvada bhavatu bhavadeyam sarvabhavate tejas 
Thank you everyone for joining. We will meet next Saturday.